Temperatures here in the Portland area forecast to reach triple digits once again. And as we all brace for another heat wave, local leaders and organizations are gearing up to try to make sure that everybody stays healthy and cool. Fox Wolves Bridget Chavez joins us live from Northwest Portland now on details how one organization is working to reach those most vulnerable. Bridget? Yeah, Wayne, Mills on Wheels People is going to be going door to door and calling seniors across the area to make sure they have what they need to keep cool. They'll also be providing rides to those who need to get to a cooling shelter. Another heat wave is on its way to the Pacific Northwest. Well, unfortunately, we are hitting that triple digits uh, again. So what we're really trying to make sure is that we get to people ahead of time and make sure that they either have somewhere to go if they're extremely vulnerable or they've got what they need in their own home to stay cool enough to survive. Suzanne Washington is the CEO of Meals on Wheels People and tells me they're working hard to make sure the most vulnerable in our community are taken care of. We have a list of several hundred people that we're calling and talking to ahead of time for that very thing, just to check in. Do they have fan? Do they have an air conditioner? If it gets too hot, can they put cool water between them and the air conditioner? Can they put ice between them and the the fan, I should say, um, do they have water or is there a place that we can get them to and making sure they also know about the cooling centers. Washington says volunteers will be checking in on people at their homes and making phone calls. They'll also deliver food, water and fans to those in need. There are folks that are on that most vulnerable side and those are the people we want to make sure we connect to and that's not always easy. Cooling shelters are expected to open up across the Portland area as temperatures rise. Specifically in Hillsboro, Mayor Steve Calloway says they'll have three cooling shelters opening starting Wednesday. The Shoot Park Library, the Brookwood Library, and then we'll have the Civic Center. All three will be open uh, for individuals who need water, cooling, and uh, just need to stay out of the heat. Calloway says the shelters will remain open until temperatures drop below 95. Anytime we have a severe weather event, whether it's something like ice and snow or something like heat, we're always going to make sure that we are providing uh, places for people to go to stay out of the elements and to stay protected and healthy. And one thing both Callaway and Washington mentioned was for all of us to make sure and check in on our neighbors. Just a quick check in can make all the difference. Reporting live in Northwest Portland, Bridget Chavez, Fox 12, Oregon.